Hi, everybody. <laughs> Who's on the line? Everyone. Everybody. I think it's all everybody. of us. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I'm so thrilled to tell you that you guys won the Tiny Desk Contest. <laughs> I tend to just assume you're not gonna win that and there's no need to try and even do that. But um, one of my best friends who happens to be the manager of Tank and the Bangers, she pushed for it hard every day. Literally the last day of submissions, we did it. Every now and then I go and teach poetry at a school called Clark. And I always went in this classroom with not tiny desks, but big ones that could fit all of us on them. So I was like, this is going to be the classroom for it. This is going to be perfect for it. The whole day was really hard uh, just getting ready for Tiny Desk because we had so many things to do in New Orleans. Everyone was trying to move around to pack up their things. Uh, yeah. The time is now 1.30, I believe, and I'm just packing. It has been crazy already. I can just imagine. I've I been walking around New Orleans, my city, and people say, Oh my God, are you tank? All I can say is yes. Wow, it's about to go. I'm not even going to say it's about to go down. I'm not going to say that. It is about to go up. Because that's the only way I'm looking. I like that, Albert. It's missing something. It's missing you. Can I get a snap? I just never thought that we could win something so big when you feel so small in New Orleans. People love people from New Orleans, but rarely do we really win. It's really amazing to be recognized. We had over 6,000 entries to this contest and trying to make some kind of uh, judgment as to who takes this place behind this desk, which is, you know, it's just a concert at a desk. But what seems to happen after these things is that you get seen by a lot of people. I absolutely know that we chose the right people. So thank you. And it's gonna be this is gonna be a good year. I'm just saying. <laughs>